Yo, what's going on, everybody? DC here, host of What The Shit. You already know your favorite podcast, your mom's favorite podcast, your auntie's favorite podcast. The only podcast you can still get on flip phones and everywhere else. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, tune in every week as we give you some of the best content we have to offer, last funds, games, and everything else. You can also catch us on the Be On Air Network, iHeart, iTunes, uh, Spotify, you know what I'm saying, Pandora, everywhere you get to streaming. Also catch us every live, every Wednesday, 8.15, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, all the above, you dig? So make sure you watch, you like, you subscribe. Peace. Enjoy the episode. What's one? T-Pain. Yeah, I What's know. Yeah, yeah. Is it T-Pain, nigga? Just T-Pain. T-Pain, nigga. I'm strong as my shit. I'm strong as my right. shit, so... I mean, if we just going to do T-Pain, because Roz is like, he's desperate to get that shit on the list. I mean, all right. I, we can name a bunch of songs that, that could possibly be in that I top love T-Pain, That's why I said I'm just, just saying, I don't, we got Bartender. We said, um, what, what was the other one we disagreed I, on? Going off of, uh, blame off of it. Impact, blame. buy your drink is like the obvious one. Buy me drink, yeah. Okay, yeah, we all have an impact. Yeah, buy remember. me a drink. I'm a buy you a drink. Ooh. I'm from... It's another one. Chopped uh, and screwed. Chopped yeah, and screwed is my shit. Not, not the top, like, it's, not the top again, five. I don't know. It's, top, top. It's a lot of. It's, I'm strong would be the, would Listen, be the top we talking If we talking about just impact alone, he got enough songs to where it ain't no point even putting a song. Just put that nigga name and call him the fucking day. No, 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 I, get what, I get what you're saying, though, man, but it is. We talking about of all time. You can't put any one of his songs all time. He got, certain, he got certain songs that he can't go. That's what he don't. Yeah, like I said, yeah, buy yeah. you a drink is his top song. Mm-hmm. I think Bartender his top song. To us, yeah, but to the impact, buy your drink. Exactly. Mm. Yeah, because I remember going out many a nights and buy you a drink, play for yeah, to buy you a drink. That's that's play every fucking time you go. That, that's like honest. you, you liable. Maybe not as much now, but you was liable to hear that shit five times. While you was out in the same oh, I've bar, heard it, I've heard it six times in one night at yeah. the club. Exactly. <laughs> yep. Between and that and um Jamie Fox at, at one. Yeah. Blaming on the alcohol. That exactly. shit. Exactly. Yeah. Three. This is where shit gets tricky. Not for me. I'll jump right in and just say "Love" by Music Soul Child. All right, that's a personal I'm, one. I've been I'll holding put. that shit in the chamber. Yeah, I'll, I'll put that number. Yeah. Hey, uh, I'm gonna say you. One twelve peaches and cream. I don't know. Mm, I, love I don't know. I don't feel like one twelve. I would pick love and cream. Would be, would be up that high. Yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all fucking with you, my lord. I love that fucking song. I I mean, know, I there's no top, top two though. Top though. Or or would you say or would you go and get it shorty? This century. Ah, as you okay. I would say over both of those. I would say um. What's the other one he had? Damn, I had it written down too. What's the other Lloyd um shit? Southside. Nah. Take me to the south side when nobody wanna hide. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love just, Laura, yeah. I you fucking love Alora, yeah. Nobody wanna listen to no songs ever. <laughs> Why <laughs> fuck with Laura? Yo. Yeah, I... <laughs> Laura, funny as shit. Uh, uh, hey, yo, no, hey, no, 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 wait, wait, it's the rock. She, the way she rock with it, she's like, like sounds like, bad. Kill that shit. Oh my god. <laughs> love uh, my yo, um, two and one. I thought right, of another one. Hello, oh, no, two for me. I got Fantasia when I see you. I was just about to say that. That's a good I was ass just song. about to say that. He took mine. He took right. mine. Confessions but, part two. Oof, that's a good ass song. That was number one. <laughs> actually, was number one on the Rolling Stone. It was and Rolling Stone. Fuck, it's great. That's a good song. Fuck. And that definitely made an impact. So, damn, what the fuck was the nigga name? Uh, R. Kelly made the list. There was no genius. No, they. Uh, no, I'm fuck, fuck, I can't. Had a thousand rapists don't make no. Put you to bed. When I see you, oh, you talking about Jay Holiday? Jay Holiday. There you go. That was, that, that's a good one too. I'm gonna say um, "Red Bone" by uh, um, uh, Charles Gambino. Nah, you you shouldn't even say that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not that one. As one of the as the top two songs, top two songs, yeah, yeah. Five years. Top, 
I had that at like 15. I just wanted to see if I could throw it in there, but yeah. <laughs> I tried. I tried. I, tried. I, just right. shit out there now. Thanks. I did just throw that out right there. Hey, just hey, threw this shit out there. Just see if it's going to Hold that thought, Brian, because the list ain't still complete. Yeah, yeah. Why no Ed Sheeran on here? Why ain't nobody talking about Ed Sheeran? Yeah, He's dope. Think about you right now. Yeah. So, what do we got at two? Right, now. Yeah. Oh, so got it All right, listen, I'm going to say this. This on some real shit. Since we said our one R. Kelly song, I'm going to definitely say Step in the Name of Love. I thought like that was number one. I'll, I'll, st- I'll stick when I see you. That's- when I see you. When I see you, Bob. When I see you, my shit. That, that's the only song that black that men and, and women will sing. Oh, you Part know of- what song we missing? That's number two, though? I, I know what song it is. That's number two, and y'all all gonna agree with me. I don't know the name of the song, but it goes a little something like this. Yep. Uh, look at fast places, fast and the whole bell. I'm yeah. just glad that your mic went out. <laughs> Mike was like, just stop it, just stop it. Your mic was like, oh, she about to be on some bullshit. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna give one more since ain't nobody else. I just want to give a shout out to Alora's mic. Since we saying, since we saying Fantasia, I got one more to combat. It. One more, one more. Ready? Mike, this some yep. bullshit. This some bullshit. I got um Alicia Keys. If I ain't got you, mm. Mm. damn, that's definitely a big. One. I think Secrets is better. Damn. Damn. Or diary. Oh. Sorry, diary. I'm going to say this is good. I had a lot of I think Ain't Got You was good. Falling was good. I think Ain't Got You was a good one. I'm so I can't even say nothing, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, but yeah, but I still stick with Fantasia, though. Mm. Yeah, I mm. like what I see you. Every, every, every gig I spend, that song is a fucking hit. And I see song. you, top two. <laughs> I did this Christmas party last month, and boy, that's I'm saying another shit. It's a dope ass song. I don't know if it's, you know it's number two. Yeah, that's a hard. That's it a hard. been on his list, but I don't think. It's yeah, I don't know about number. Yeah, I think it's been on the list too. What if Brandy, we you know say it works? Genuine, so anxious, so anxious. I thought that was one of that, that was one of my ones I was about to put on here too. Nah, yeah. but not the yeah, top, just, not the top. That was like twenty five. I, I was I trying to take a book out your pages. Name shit. I would book. I know. Hey, listen, it works sometimes. All right, so I'll 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 allow Fantasia to sit it too for now, because Brandy knows how this shit works. Uh, what I'm else? Twice. Yeah. All right, number <laughs> one. You know. The fucking. Right. <laughs> hey, hey, I got I got number one. Right, I yeah. got number one. I got number one for sure. Here we go. Yeah, no, yeah, number one. Hey, so, so what do you, what do you win if you got the most uh songs on here? A, a, a Glory, trip back to the, a trip back to the damn song, the damn show again, part two. Yeah, no, got you. I, I win my black card back. That's what I got on the line. I'm trying to win my black card back. Well, that motherfucker is hanging up by the three. <laughs> Damn. Yo, very loose, oh, no. especially, especially <laughs> with that saying. Hey, hey, that lanyard right now is so tattered. That motherfucker. Hey, this oh. year, I'm gonna be allowed to sit at the space table. Ooh, with my you black know what? Card. Here's how you get your back black card again. back. Here's how you get your black card back. Never sing again. <laughs> hey yo, one. shoot for the stars, bro. Shoot for the stars. Number one. All right, all right number one. I go first. Ron hey, Isley. Ron <laughs> Isley. Contagious. Oh, I like that. I had Contagious on my shit. I, like I wouldn't know if that's number one though, but Ron that's Isley up there. Contagious. I like Contagious. That might be. Fuck that. It might be. <laughs> yeah, I agree. That was my shit. Mm. I agree. Two thousand and one. Ron Isley. Too yeah, I'm gonna probably have to go. Um, I'm gonna go with Britney Spears. Oh, baby, baby. That was 98. Damn it. That was <laughs> Somebody who was trying to get that black card. You can get that motherfucker snatched. Come on, come on. Come on. You know Britney slaps. Britney fucking slaps. Hey, what was that movie? ATL where that nigga uh, T.I. snatched those girls' chain off. Mm. <laughs> That's how everybody you snatched your black card. Like, give me that shit. I'm holding on for dead life. Number one, contagious. Yeah, I put that number one. Number one is contagious. Damn, I nobody got anything else for number one spot. Uh, I got, I got lovers and friends. Usher, Lil John, and Ludacris. I don't know about number one. It should be on the list. Oh my god! <laughs> I don't know. I didn't, I didn't factor that in as R and B because I, I guess that's R and B. Just yeah. that's R&B. It's definitely R and B. Little hip hop in it. Oh, you know what? 
Oh, I know a good song that would be number one. Uh, I'm Justin Timberlake and Beyonce's remix. Cause your love was all I had. Oh, that, that was a good song. Well, that ain't no number one. I thought that song, but I don't know. Yeah, that, that, was, that was a good song. Contagious. So sick, Neil. Nobody said any Trey songs. Not for number one. <laughs> not for number one. No, not for number one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just going back. I'm trying to trying to make sure we make sure we ain't missing nothing here. Yeah, there was number twenty-seven. Uh, Contagious. Only uh, good Trey songs. I, I never would have thought of that. It was dope. Busted. Song, we got busted. Oh, busted. Yeah. What's busted? What's that? Another Ron Arsley song. Busted. Mm-hmm. Two damn clock in the morning. Where you been, baby? I'm never, I Wait a minute. What, was that was that ninety nine though? Yeah, that was no. like that was like two thousand one, two thousand two. Oh, okay, that was, yeah. it, was, it, was, it was the whole contagious three old thing they was doing. What about a heartbreak hotel? Oh hell yeah! Oh, hell hell yeah. back. I forgot all about all that shit. Not that huh? Damn. Yeah. Exactly. I don't know. Forgetting that all this, all this shit. Really well. well. That song did really well for a long time. I need a number one. So Neo, so sick. Neo, so, so sick. sick was my shit. I don't know if it's number one, but I would love that. Or because of you. I like Neo. He ain't number one. Or Neo, when you mad? When you mad? That was my. That was one of my favorite Neo song. That is fire. But I don't. Or, I, or as independent. Much woman. of a Neo fan as I am, I wouldn't put. I don't think I would put none of his. Songs I wouldn't put it at the top. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm thinking that same shit. Except for Lazy Love. But I need a number one. Damn, what is that guy name? One. The damn the one guy, I'm looking for shit, man. I got little songs here. What has beat contagious yet? What has beat it? I don't know. I'm just trying to make sure because oh, well, we're talking about number one. Do number one, right? Yeah. Hey, look, look, look. We might change I'm... this list later, but right now I'm just... lay, lay, lay it down. down. That was the voice I'm talking about. I'm being honest. <laughs> hey, Brad, contagious, <laughs> contagious is my shit, but I actually, I always, me personally, I always like busted more than contagious. Hold on, let me tell y'all something. The fact that this man drove his six around. Looking ooh, for his missing lady. Ooh, ooh, RL he and Deborah Cox. We can't be friends. That's a fucking. Real, that's a hit. Got back in and realized she was in the house the whole damn time. <laughs> in the next room. That's a weird shit. Yeah. So, <laughs> Lord, that might have been the dopest shit you said all night. I, I'm not. I'm not even hating it, but that that one right there. That's a hit right there. Mm-hmm. RL and Deborah Cox. Well, I don't know if it's number. I don't know if it's number one though. I don't know, man. I can't think Perfect. of shit else. Oh, 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 hold on. I'll, I'll put a song in there to help to, to contend with it. Um, I, was, speaking I, of Deborah Cox, um, what was it? Um, nobody supposed to be here. Yeah, that came out later, I think. That was, was like that? 96, 97. My love was a little, little bit. Later. I think it was a little. You sure? No, I think so. That song, uh, uh-uh, that song came out in two thousands. We can. We can. Nobody supposed to be here. Oh, nobody's going to be done loving for the last time. My heart said no, no. Yeah, I think those, that's the only two songs I, I put as contenders. Dope. Yeah, I stayed by Lovers and Friends or You. But number one. That's why I stayed by me. Yeah, no, so that's 98. 98. Yeah, 98. Might supposed to be here was 98. 98, okay, yeah. Okay, one of your choice. Well, Contagious still up there, so um, 2001. Contagious, busted, lovers and friends. Yeah, blurred uh, lines, blurred lines from uh oh, Robin Thicke. Lost without you, lost Tamia, without you from Robin Thicke. Mia, Mia, stranger in my house. Okay. That was like number one. That was like number one. That's better than all the And that's so, so, so you saying that to me? A song is the greatest song in the last twenty five years. Oh damn, my bad. But that's oh, what I'm God. saying. Is are we saying that contagious is as well? Because that shit is. I don't. I, even though I love uh, it, I don't think that's the oh, best I, song in the last 25 years. Because like everybody don't even know that song. Don't that's, even. That just shows you how garbage music has been. No, it's not. <laughs> that shows you well, how this music has been garbage. Here's the thing. Here's here's what y'all don't realize. This shows you how good music has been. Because a lot of we're naming songs that most people don't know or naming songs that some of us may not have heard and we knocking songs off like oh that can't go above this song so it's been a lot of great music that's why it's so yeah. hard to say a number one song 
I'm talking about, what about in, the, uh, in this, like, in this, like <clears throat> the later 2000s. You can't find nothing in the book. I, later 2020s, I'll say. That's I not, stopped, that's I stopped writing. I stopped writing after fucking 2019. I'm going to be honest with you. I, I was just skipping I was going to say Victoria Monet in that, in that 15 to 20 range, but I figured y'all was going to shut that shit down. If I would have got in earlier, I probably would have said Snooze, because Snooze is a very popular song. Everybody asked me for it. Oh, John Legend. All of me. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I'll put it Cranes in, what is it? Cranes in the sky or some shit like that? Oh, that's my shit. Um, uh, that's um, shit, though. Blanche. Yeah. A lot of people never going to get number one. Like, it's a lot of songs that <laughs> technically <laughs> could be on this list. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Saying the top 25 is difficult. Very. Unless you say the top song of each year for 25 years. Mm, yeah. yeah, that that's a really good point, actually. Bar, that's probably bar, one of the best sure. things to fucking do. I'm, yo, I'm telling you, I literally, I got on the sides, I got over 100 fucking songs. I've been looking at them, but I don't think any one of them fit as a number one spot song. <laughs> I now, wish Carl Thomas. Brian, let me ask you this. You said you got 100 songs written down. I right. got a hundred fucking so like over. Actually. Was these was these twenty four songs? Y'all. Was all twenty four of these songs on your list? No, no, not even. See what I'm saying? Not even. Yeah, yeah, nah. <laughs> it was a hundred out of each year, so that's twenty years. Tw- at least Wait a yeah, twenty you years wrote with a hundred songs. songs for every year. <laughs> nah, nah, I went through. I went through. You got way too much time yeah, nah. on your hands, my nigga. Nah, damn. I only took about an hour. I'm trying to be prepared and shit. But, um, <laughs> my man, my man, I'm trying to get this shit in for real. This is my shit, right? Oh, I love this shit. I still need a one because there's there's a second part to the list. Now I know there's a second, God, damn, a second part. part. Okay, so oh, 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 that song by Chris Brown because that's a good good song. Say He's goodbye, like, fucking robot thing. I don't know well, how you like the, you like the freakiest baby, song. I, you you, make, you make everybody not want to listen to no songs you like. You talking about under the influence? Man, you heard my feelings roll down, man. <laughs> <laughs> like, the way you, you sing it, I don't want to hear it. Nigga, what have you ever known me to be like that? What the fuck? He's a female. Nigga, I'm not Ralph Chuzman, nigga. The fuck? I ain't Ralph Chuzman. I ain't fucking Carl Thomas. Hey yo, she said. That's a song I would name, but all he said was, "I like this song." You don't know what I want to listen to. Oh, so he's talking about I make people not want to listen to music, nigga. You make people I'm not want to date. I'm Mister Irrelevant. I can say what the fuck I want. Fuck you talking about? Oh damn! Now we back on me. I ain't never gonna live it down. Uh, I'm sober yo, today. Don't make me start roasting because I roast back. DC, your show bringing us to war, man. What the fuck are you doing over here? Yeah, DC is <laughs> just letting us go. This nigga, just letting them go and shit. Yeah, they better get some control, yeah. motherfucker. I need one. So, all right, so we <laughs> gonna go. If y'all didn't, if y'all Love didn't and know, Love DC and live Tamar. for this shit. DC living for this shit. Love and war by Tamar. Plotting. Oh my god, that was a good song. Love, Love and War was a really good song. Not number yeah, one but, good, but it was a good but we song. Prefer, but we prefer we ain't gonna never get a number one song. We don't pick yeah, something. We ain't never gonna get a number one song. You know what? We I got, got our own preference. That's the fucking problem. Jingo DC, break the break, break the um break the tie, yo. Yeah, whatever. Break the tie. You gotta break it. Yeah. That's why I stick my number one song. Oh yeah, yeah. That, that, that can't. Say go. No, how? How did you? How did you that I got y'all. This. Two part conversion, eight and three. Nope. I don't got y'all. Uh, yeah, yes, I do. We're gonna go with this one. How you spell it? Mm. <laughs> Damn, you spelled that shit crazy. Continue, we get the. Got like four songs in mind trying to spell that shit. All right, so. The the second part of the list is hold as up, y'all have to do with everybody. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. What about R. Kelly feeling on your booty? Oh, 
Man, I don't support rapists. Yeah. I feel like Seven Name of Love should be up there if um we looking at anything. R. Phil, if you feel on your booty, the impact. Feel your booty was a shit. We take we take an ignition off. We take an ignition remix off of that. That nigga said, "Fill it on your booty." Yeah, I would I would take ignition remix off and then, and at least have "Step in the Name of Love" on that shit. Wait I mean, a minute, <laughs> ain't no way y'all telling me it's not. And that's disrespectful to have that no two songs in the twenties. Step in the Name that, of Love. That's what I'm saying. Like "Step in the Name of Love" is is still being like, so Tig, I know you know that shit. We so putting all of this shit above. That's the old people wow. fucking um. Here's uh, the uh, here's song. Here's the Here's, the, here's what the second part of the list is. Oh, good God. Yeah, I know. There's, there's, there's some songs you guys sound like you guys clearly want on. Somebody got to go for that to happen. All the slots are filled. Who's being sacrificed for filling on your booty? Nobody. Nothing about that sound right, my nigga. Hey, yo. <laughs> Hey, nothing about that sound right, right my nigga. Are Kelly oh. sitting somewhere right now, feeling on one of his fucking inmate, uh, fellow inmates? Ah. Right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think it's the other way around. I think. I think. I think. What the fuck? I think they're going. They go, they go, the artist. The they feeling on his shit. Our <laughs> Kelly in there. Prison, his name just gonna be Kelly. I heard two different songs. Uh, you had a song that you wanted to put in. You had a, at like fifteen. Brian, you said you want to somebody got to go unless y'all this is this least is this list how y'all feel it's in. I feel like Roz was right when he said, um, as far as impact, I feel like I feel like there's a couple that should come out because Lovers and Friends should be on here because that was definitely a huge song. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Who you gonna take off the list? Bro, every time I play that song at a gig, bro, everybody know that song. Sing it. Like, I, I didn't say it because it's got hip hop in it, but I, I mean, hey, I understand the cultural impact, but somebody got to go for lovers and friends to make the list. Who gonna be go vote up the island? It is LMA. I think. First off, first off, we LMA made so, the list. So, all right, here's the thing. Uh, yeah, you can, we, if we talk about lovers and friends, right? Yeah, what, uh -huh. what's, I love it. Can come off of there. Uh, yeah. Let me love you can come off of there. Oh, we, I'm just naming. Nah, let no, me love you. Oh, let me love listen, you. listen to me. Oh, listen to me. All I want listen to me. Oh, I'm naming fun. songs that these songs aren't as good as that song. I'm not saying it necessarily what spot, but there's certain songs on here where when you're thinking of lovers and friends, a lot of these songs ain't even competing with that shit. Really, but in different time periods, it was it was a top song, just like Lovers and Friends. Lovers was. and Friends can still be played to this day. Fuck you mean? I'm telling so you. So could fucking Elvis. He's another one you just no. named. No. All oh, I know is, is Lovers and Friends. We talking about R&B songs. Now, nobody got them off. Yo, we gonna go to war, man. That's oh, fucking crazy. Yeah, I'm about to <laughs> bow out. Like, I say, fuck it. What y'all doing? All right, we can read the list. How it is? It's up to y'all. We all know in our heart this ain't the top 25 fucking R&B songs last 25 years. It's not. But it's still a list we made. Yeah. And it's, it's better than it's better than um Rolling Stone shit. It's fuck yes. I agree with that. I do agree, I agree with that. With that. Mm -hmm. I'll make it make it make it. We got oh, what, was the, what was the top 25 on Rolling Stone? Man? Some bullshit. Uh, uh shit. Some bullshit. I gotta go back. I got it right here. We have at the top of ours was at the bottom of their shit, and they did a hundred. It really was. It really was. Nice. Top twenty-five. How about we start by saying the songs we think should definitely stay? Uh, music Soul Child for sure. Yeah, I think Love by Music should definitely be up there. Fantasia should stay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'll just Buy your drink, definitely. Is. Buy your That's drink. Yeah, too. I agree. Oh, wait, wait. Roll the Stone, number one, they had Confessions. Yeah. Confessions should probably be on this list. Confessions honestly. should be on that list, man. 2004, yeah. That whole fucking album. Uh, uh, okay. I hear y'all. 
So Who number, coming off? I, I can read that. So, so, <laughs> so number two, number two, they had Untitled by D'Angelo. They came out. Oh yeah, ninety nine. Yeah, yeah, right now, yeah. No, two thousand. They had uh, Dangerously in Love by Beyonce. Oh, you know what? Yeah. I will be I will be uh willing to sacrifice tank for um Usher. Um Ooh, I see. you feeling in your body, you found some I, body. I thought, I thought I thought I was tripping, bro. It's, they got number four Mary Mary, Mary J. Blige on Be Without You. I knew that was a top ten song. That's that that's <laughs> definitely up there too. I, that was a top 10. I was I was gonna say it, but I kind of hesitated. I was the Rolling Stone shit wasn't as bad as y'all made it out to be. <laughs> no, no, it was fucking bad. They did a hundred, really bro. Bad. We only doing twenty five. That shit was. They had music soul child love at like fucking fifty. Nigga, what? That's hey, yo, right. bro, that shit crazy, yo. That's what the fuck? Hey, hey, Listen, hey, you talking everything you made it up, bro? No, no, you my nigga, though. Nigga, what? I, I love music soul child, but he ain't he ain't top ten like like impact most popular. He bro, ain't. When, when he came out, oh, it was. Okay. When he came out, it was. Of it. That shit, yeah. nah, man, that song's better than that. Yeah, 50, that's crazy. Who's coming off? Who's going on? Okay, so I think we should put Mary J. Blige. We need to take some more. I think Mary J. Blige should be on there. Who she replaced? Yeah, right. It's disrespectful not to have her on here. I ain't say that. All right, who should replace him? Don't. Replace, replace don't. How's the love making? Ooh. God damn. Hold on. Yeah, I would say replace it. Yeah, don't. I would replace don't. Yeah. Replace like don't. Them. Yeah. But that's saying we're, we're making Mary J. Blige number 15? Yeah, that's cool. For now? That's cool. For now. Yeah, she's the best thing in the world. She's the best thing in the world. Yeah. That's the problem. Oh, was it be without you? <laughs> 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 is, is J. Cole an R&B singer? Nah, no, he's a rapper. No, he's a rapper. <laughs> <laughs> All right, That's so uh, Don is out. Who else? That's another one, Miguel. Sure thing. Like, why the fuck you ain't on the list? I don't think no. that was top twenty-five. No, I don't think top twenty-five. No. I don't think "Be Without You" was neither, but y'all put it on there. "Be Without I You." Just, I mean, we said impact like though. On there. Short, did short impact, thing man. have an impact? Like, like, like uh, "Be Without You." Yeah, you Family Fair made a bigger impact than Be Without You, though. I said that shit a long I, I time think ago. So, I think it's so disrespectful. Y'all don't have the king of R&B up here. You know, Ooh. Jack. I, I said Butterfly. Oh, I, I, was, I, was like, damn, I was like, damn, Bobby Brown hey, made a song in a long time. Do you see? Do your mute button work? <laughs> <laughs> she said, you thank you. I like you, but don't do that. The fuck with Jack Queen. Get the fuck. <laughs> oh, Jack Queen. That's what she said? I didn't even hear that. I thought he was talking about Michael Jackson. Uh, Michael Jackson. <laughs> yeah, he tripping over there. <laughs> talking about Bobby Brown. I'm talking about King R&B. Michael Jackson. Uh, King Pop. All right. So are we cool with the list now? Big Big Art. Put on and R. Kelly or Usher. You got Contagious. When I See You. Love. Buy You a Drink. Umbrella. Yeah, this, this list feels yeah. wrong. Bro. Yo, what's that uh, Daniel Caesar and her song? Oh. Uh, uh, best part. Yeah, that bitch need to be on here. Are we gonna, 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 um, are we gonna name ordinary people? No, no, yeah, no, 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 no. A lot of these motherfuckers are ordinary people now. Yeah, we're good. We're good. That's number twenty-eight. Oh, I love you. Oh no. So I also let's, feel let's, like um, Sex from uh, Life was, um, listen, was let's, definitely let's a big time. Beat. Let's be honest with with ourselves though, for real, for real. I love it. Is that really a top 25 song in the last 25 years? No. Like, let's keep it a being. I'm not even about the cap, though. He really should have had the Proud Family theme on here. Cause that's hey, man, like, you're mute. you slow as shit with the mute button, my nigga. What's up? <laughs> 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 nigga, if this was my show, she would have muted. As soon as she started saying that bullshit, she would have said P and it would have been muted. Fuck you, mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I definitely don't think August Osana should have should have been on it, but I also don't know all a lot of new new okay, shit. So. Top twenty five, yeah. Take that. I'm not saying it's hard to do ninety nine to two thousand twenty three. That's just difficult. You should put one Leah song because she was lit. Who? Try again yeah. by Leah should definitely be on the list. Try no, again rock, over rock, all of Leah's shit. Rock, mm. rock the boat by Leah should be on the list. Yeah, rock. My yeah, boat. Rock, rock the boat would probably be a better. I I, I would put on the list. Oh, they got that song. I think number fourteen. 
or something like that. Oh, yeah, we, rock we the boat. They got no 15 on Rolling Stone. Or Damn. come over. I do like come over. Oh, um, come over came out like nice. Over my shit too. No, no, all that was on the same. All, all that was on the same album. Yeah. Oh shit. Come out like nice. Like 2000. Try again was 90. Was 90. Well, that might have been 99. That was a. Oh, it was 2001. Who was 24? Because mm. we voted Augustine out. Somebody got to go. Y'all voted August out? Yep. Mm-hmm. I mean, he should have never been up there to begin with. Let's be real. He was just, like, a, he was just an entanglement anyway. So. He's just going to go back to Jada. So I'm looking at, <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you. I'm, I'm looking at songs based off what the song was and what the song did. So. Number 21, I don't Wait, see that as a top put, 25 ooh, song. Ooh, 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 I got, got some right for y'all. Right, let's let's put, keep it a big. Put, put, put Diddy Sousa. High. Right Diddy High. Um, hey, that was a great song. But that was my shit. That was like a top what 25 song. What would you do song, when someone was at Richard home? Bro, Claudia from City that, High. Um, that was my shit, bro. Five round nine. Yeah. Nine one one. Mary J. Blige and Y. Clef. That bitch should be on here. Yeah, that was a fucking hit right there. Yeah, that was a fucking that was a hit. Was Let's a be hit. real though. Um, um, I'm real. Um, with uh, uh Ja Rule and fucking J Lo, that yeah. shit no, was hitting good. hard no, too. Now we got. Found out that J Lo, that was not really. Yeah, just tell somebody, please find Ja Rule. Oh, this motherfucker, so I can make sense of all this shit. You mean Ja Rule and Ashanti? Yeah. Because it was. It was. It was. Now we got two open spots because we just started voting stuff off. You gotta put something there. I'm gonna let, go. let you. I got three of my songs still on there, so have fun with it. <laughs> hey, hey, dude, like I got three. I'm cool yeah. <laughs> for now. Oh, uh, did, we, did we put confessions on? Nope. Where are we going? Uh, somebody, hey, for There's somebody to make the list, go somebody got to go off. We could we could take off 17 and put confessions for sure. I don't know. Refill should stay though. Mm, I, don't I, don't like know, is... I mean, don't get me wrong. Refill, refill was a dope down, song. Put Hell of an impact. Yeah, yeah, put it down there. Yeah. For now. Mm-hmm. For now. <laughs> yeah. I... That's personally where I would put it at 17. They got to rank the number one. But I would personally put it about right. Yeah, I don't think it's number one. That's I'll... a better song. Oh. Uh, all right. So number 21. Yeah. Yeah. Else we so what is what is what is sixteen? Uh, ready for love by Indiari. Somebody sing it. Somebody I'm besides Eric. I can't. No, 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 no. Somebody yeah. besides Alora. My bad, Eric. You can sing it. Damn. <laughs> I don't even know that. Brian, 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 Brian told me he don't let the song fight say. I don't know what the fuck to say no more. Um, oh damn. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm talking about the India Ire song. What the fuck? No, no, no. It is a good song. Though. I just I'm really not gonna is. sing it in the key. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna do that to myself. I'm good. But it's a good song. I don't know it. Oh, um, Sunshine yeah, Anderson. Sunshine Anderson. Um, heard it all before. That was my shit. But uh, I should be on this yeah. list. Yeah. Hold on, I didn't say take it off, man. No. Yeah, well, you gonna go down? She gonna go down for now. Okay. So okay. what is this what safe? Thing? This safe? No. I don't think Contagious is definitely not. If anything, I would put Love Music Soul Child at number one or Incomplete by Cisco. How is is Incomplete even on the list? Nope. That's crazy. Yeah, but I can't put put Love over Contagious. How about In the Closet? We can't put that up there? (laughs) That was a statement when he did that shit, though. I I, I wouldn't say it. He was was, was living in the truth. I wouldn't necessarily call that a top song. Yeah, I don't know what it, in the it was an was. event. It was funny as hell, but it won't. It's not. So, a, it's not a good R&B. Why we ain't got Michael up there? Michael, he did. Damn, Damn. 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 shit. Damn, who Uh, <laughs> you telling me wifey wasn't supposed to go on this list right here? Wifey, apparently not. Wifey made a whole hold fucking up, hold movement. Up, hold up! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! We have not one song, not one song from the Emancipation of Mimi on this list. Nope. Yeah, that's it. Yep. That's that's true. True. It's yeah. no way at least one of them songs ain't making this list. I just can't believe Destiny Child ain't on there. I said, I, same, I, yo, never, listen, I said these fucking songs. I already now. told y'all I'm never voting nothing Beyonce. So uh, you know what? You know, if you're gonna, if you're going you gonna do Destiny Child, cater to you. It's the best yeah, I'm song. Saying, they got like, y'all gonna say my name? 
I'm hearing a lot of what should be on there, but I'm not hearing what should be coming off. We we got to belong together. What's coming off? Okay. this list. Okay. You see the way that that. Who got to go? And if hold up, not no no no, my bad. Finds the love making. Oh, yeah. either we belong together or shake it off should be on this list somewhere. We belong together. I I know we, belong together. we belong together. I think. We belong together. We belong together. I like, I like it's way better. We, we should, we should we have, have shake it off on this list. Oh. Now, honestly, Fox no, no, Taylor's uh, Swift was a pop singer, but shake it off. You have to shake it off, Taylor Swift, Laura. What's coming off? Somebody got to go bye bye. Just like that tank Tyree, either, Marie. either seven or eight. I'm sorry, Eric. I'm sorry. I gotta seven or eight. Either one. You're right. Seven. Seven. Go. Tyree. <laughs> Tyree's got go. <laughs> I would have left Tyree before I left Tank up there. Me personally, I would have too. What? Yeah. Tank. See. See. When he's a good song, but it's not even his most impactful song. Not at all. At all. It don't go. It was. It's a good I, song. I, I, I know, just I know it. two songs is they. What, what would you consider to be the best? I would say I would have left signs of love making over when we I, I would take you, off and put man roll roll just because you fucked to that last night do not mean we should have that song on here. All right, please don't go was definitely a better song than when all, we I don't worry lie. about my wood, my nigga. Mind your business. Oh, I said nothing about I said nothing about your wood now. I said you fucked to it. That's two different things. <laughs> you might have been moving. Yeah. But anyway, this not neither. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, real quiet talking about wood and shit. This shit, this shit, this shit right, starting well, start problems. Y'all forgot to sit <laughs> pause. We cool with the list. Y'all like it where it's at? I don't think you oh, realize, no. right? When certain ones of us get together, it's always going to be like this. It is oh, well, hey, listen, I'm learning, man. I'm learning. Hold on, hold on. Wait till next weekend. You'll see. Oh, shit, yeah. All right, all right. <laughs> You'll see how crazy this shit really get. You ain't been around all of us at the same time. Trust me. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, not not yet. When I see you, uh, can we get when I see you out of here? Because yeah, I think I, I don't think that shit should have been that high. You said what? When yeah, I, I see you, bro, that should not be that high, man. Y'all, y'all act like it's the fucking greatest songs. We're talking twenty five years. <laughs> Yo, hold on. When I see you, should I be that high, bro? Here, here's what I'll say. Here's what I'll say. Do I like, think it's the number two song? No, but it definitely is definitely one of those top five songs, though. It should be top five. It gotta be the top, top five. five. It gotta be. Damn, we don't got no Ariana Grande on here, though. I don't Man, think. Um, I don't think. Uh, DC, uh, the, what's up with you on the mute button? Cause... Fantasia is over <laughs> confessions, man. I'm doing Why a lot. But you know, <laughs> you know uh, I'm trying uh, to make me know, say know, shit know, to you at this point. Number one should be Usher. Yeah, Fantasia, when I see you, is a good, is a big impact on, especially on the black community. It really yeah. is. I, mean, they love it. I, mean, I just, you. I don't think it would be number two, but it, it's definitely yeah. high on the list for sure. So, here's my thing. All right, uh, as far as number one, shaky at best. I'll let it ride for now. Two, not really feeling it. I think love probably should be higher. <laughs> Uh, I, agree. I agree. I agree. Might have to go. I, 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 how about this? We can switch two and three. How about oh, I, we? Uh, how we two, how two, about two, we two, add two. um uh just in case from Jaheen from Ghetto Love? I love that fucking song, but I don't think it's yeah. in this list though. I, I love that song. It was one of his, his top no. songs. Though. That's one of my favorite Terrible. songs from Jaheen. Terrible. Put a woman first, if anything, if we was doing anything. Like, oh, if we're going to put Jaheim on his bitch, it's going to be that. That one. was on the top 100, <laughs> wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. I would put that in my top 100. I wouldn't put it in the top 25. I just feel like, even though Jaheim a crackhead now, I feel like he deserves to be on this list. <laughs> Hey, uh, I think he's a crackhead. Eric, I'm trying so hard, man. You told me to be nice. I'm trying, cuz she's making this difficult, though. She really is. I love you, bro. No, this shit is fun as hell, though. I'm down to do more lists like this. I fuck with this. This is cool as shit. Hey, 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 Brian, Brian. What's up? This, uh, we need to do this for a Halloween episode list. Man. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, like um, yeah, like horror movies and shit. I'm, I'm definitely going to see How the fuck 25 shit. keep coming off the list? What's going on, DC? Oh, uh, because I, I, I kicked out uh, Umbrella and somehow it just took the whole number. So now we got a new number. 
DC, DC work. You working hard, brother. I, 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 I give you that. You working wow. hard. Wow. I. Wow. I'm I'm trying not to veto shit. I don't think I, I feel like oh, maybe... that's what we forgot. We forgot Vito. That Ooh. Frank Ocean Ooh. should come off too. Act like nah, y'all know who Vito I is. I don't know who Vito yeah, is. He, he had one song. I know you're talking about. He had one song. Uh, he got more than one song. He got two songs. Oh. Got... Oh. <laughs> oh wow. A whopping oh. two. More than one. Uh how about birthday sex by Jeremiah? <laughs> now you just name and shit for real. Really? I feel you though. Number oh, one guy song, R. Kelly song, Chris Brown song. Oh no. I, no. You know that song. You know by, what? I, um, do, I do really do we have Chris Brown on this list at all? No, that's why I said they playing. That say oh, goodbye yeah. song. Never right time to say goodbye. I think I definitely think that should be top 25. I personally like dude. We should have, we should I think with you is better. We should have that P. Diddy song on here. Y'all remember that song? I need a girl too. Yeah, I, 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 the girl part. Nope. No Diddy is cool. That's hip hop and RB, man. I, I I would say that's more hip hop yeah, and RB. I didn't say it earlier because it's a little bit more on. It's a little bit of mixture. So, so it's like um fabulous and the Tamiya. I mean, that shit was blowing up hard for a while. What is it? Hey, so speak up. What about Kenya? That's the wrong song, <laughs> That's the wrong song, baby. Oh, my God. Laura. I was close. Laura funny as shit, close. though. I was really close, though. Yeah. Hey, y'all talking about, well, hey, about me last Thursday, and Laura got it tonight. Yeah, okay. Laura got it tonight. I thought I had it, but Laura, Laura got it. Uh, Laura got it tonight. So, this list... Is the list? Um, it's still got twenty five to it. Swimmingly, as I, as I was hoping. Um, so, how about this? You guys want to take a break? We reconvene, come back right. tomorrow. We had two hours. I yeah, we mean, two hours. That's crazy. Yeah, it's been two hours. And this list don't. I don't feel like everybody feel like the list is where they wanted to be. So we can reconvene. You guys can, uh, you know. Hey, you know what? I this don't is why black men no get my, my, my songs are on the list. I'm happy. They this is why black men always getting convicted because I know fucking jurors being there like, bitch, what? <laughs> I'm okay with it. Except that top three. Yeah, top three? Yeah. What? What bro, if, you, if you think love does not belong in top three on R&B list, I don't know, bro. Yeah. No, hell, hell, I don't know. Hell, Rolling Stone didn't believe love belongs in any part of the list. I'm going to be honest. I'll take my bias hat off because love, I'm, I love that song. But yeah. But if you want to run it's gonna get on the list. I would move. I, I would remove I Miguel. Should be number one. I would remove Miguel well, and Contagious. Everyone know when I see you. Everyone know that song. Everyone. When I see you, gotta sing that. Now. Everybody and sing what, that. What? What is this? Ella refill. What the fuck? I ain't never heard that song. She want to refill yes, on a did. drink. Get the fuck out of here. You know you heard that song. Oh my daddy, I ain't never heard that song. I'm right there. I'm not about to try to sing that shit, but I know. You gotta, you gotta hit that damn high note. <laughs> yeah, we know you bull. We know you bullshit. I ain't knowing that shit. <laughs> hey, no, you know, on my, you know, on my soul, I never heard that song. I know two LMA songs. Three. Buddha. What? Shot Clock. Well, that's, 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 that's not LMA. That's, that's, it's a, that's oh, a, a different artist. Dale Vonna. Oh. Dale Vonna. Oh, 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 my bad. Okay. When I transferred it. It didn't transfer. Um, so, <laughs> right. I'm, I'm just, I'm going to just Let's scroll the list and y'all tell me y'all cool with it. Y'all not. It's up to y'all. I feel like Wicked Games could definitely come off the top 25 now that I'm really looking at it. Thank you. What do you replace Wicked Games with? I'm not sure yet. This Brown song. I mean, I mean, he I, got I a, feel I mean, like got... I feel like we definitely ain't picked the right. If we're gonna put Mary J on this list, that's not the right song to put on there. You don't feel like that was the top, that was one of the ones that made it, the biggest impact for her though. I mean, family affair is I would say. Think. Fam family affair definitely had a bigger impact. They don't, yeah, I, do I, think, I, I do think be, oh, but I do think be without you did did made an impact though. Like it, it did, wasn't... it did. But I, but family affair definitely did a bigger one. And I would the only other one I can honestly say is um the what's the one um let's ride ride. Uh, I just want to have fun. Da, 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 whatever you talking right. about. You talking about um I know you talking about. I know you talking about. Be hey, the fool with them fun oh, fine, fine, away fine. from be you. Fine. Fine, fine. Yeah, just fine, just fine. Just just fine. fine. Yeah. Yeah. Those are the three that I think of when I think of Mary. I, don't know, I think just fine to me is better than Family hey. Affair though. Hey. Nah, hey. I fuck DC, that, what the fuck you doing? What the hell you doing? He, he's rolling the crowd. DC, I have a question because yes. I 
we're always doing either rap or R and B. I really feel like we should do the top PBS songs, the top Disney Man, songs. What the fuck is up with you and your mute button, my nigga? Yeah, I'm, I'm like, so, <laughs> hey, Lou, I love you, but I'm starting to agree with Raw now. Saying <laughs> 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 any fucking thing. I agree a little bit with Raw now. Hold on, I'm being serious. Eric G, I've been trying, my nigga. Hey, yo, I didn't say that. Did you did you hear me say a word? This is not an inclusive. This is not an inclusive list. Look, DC checked out. DC ain't. Are music is not inclusive to black people? Yeah, I'm I'm blackish. I'm not. I feel like I'm, like, not I'm gonna be honest. Honestly speaking, if we would have took this list back a lot farther, I definitely would have had John B on this list. Oh, Fuck man. Yeah. which one? Which one? Which one? Let's see, Rob. Let's see what we got. What's John B song that anybody's gonna name? Really? No, nah, not just one. If we, if we talk about top love. songs, if we talk about say again. Don't talk. My John B, they too close. I think uh, Nexus is another. They don't know. They don't, they don't know. know. Oh, that's don't know. Shit. That's that would have been the t- that definitely would have been on don't the Don't ever get the top five. Fucking bullshit. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, okay. oh. But we, we ain't go back that far. So, but then you got to go to Brandy. How have you ever? Then you got to go. That's just um. That could be on this list. Well, have, have you ever? No, have you ever? It's like was that ninety? Ninety eight. That was this time. It was ninety nine. We would the ninety. I would have put Lauren Hill. I ain't Man, we would have went to the 90s. This list would 90% of the songs on here. <laughs> that's not even would be off. off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it would be, off. It would be oh, Mariah. It would be Whitney. It would be a bunch of shit on here. New edition. Yeah. New edition. Monica, oh, Brandy, all of them. Would be on this no, Boys to Men, Drew Hill. Yeah, it would be a crazy oh, list. Oh. Mm-hmm. We'd be here for a fucking year. Anyway. <laughs> Let's get them to the end of the day because it's past my bedtime. <laughs> yeah, it's starting, to, it's starting to get a little. Right, right. A little into it. 13 though. Serious. Yeah, DC, pick one, bro. I'm just an unbiased uh, judge here. I am not even a part of this. How about we slide every song ooh, down? Ooh, ooh. Jennifer Hudson. Number one definitely ain't right. How about Jennifer Hudson? Spotlight. I don't like Spotlight. That was a good one. That oh, was every good one. song? That means Riri comes off the list? No, no, no. I'm talking about from the top. If you slide every song down and then you got number one open, because that's contagious is definitely not number one. It definitely not. Definitely. Number one should be an Usher song, a Chris Brown song. Yeah, if we go by popularity, I would say I would say yeah by Usher. Song, like it's you I would say yeah by Usher is number one if we go on popularity. Well, yeah, that's, that's well, yeah but Usher is five. Um so you want to move yeah to number one, right? I would say that's the that's the out of all the songs on this list right here. That's the yeah. most popular one in my hey, opinion. DC, you know you can literally just highlight the whole thing and bring it down. Oh, I don't want to. You keep talking. Okay, well, it's your show. Yeah. I'm trying I'm to give y'all time to talk. <laughs> Nigga, you see we is confused. Don't know what the hell we're doing. I know. <laughs> but I was giving y'all more time to be confused. <laughs> the confusion breeds envy. <laughs> <laughs> well, y'all just stop talking now. Everybody's like, oh, no. Nah. I think everybody just kind of stuck in what we can uh, put in this list. I don't think we ever going to come to full fucking agreement. I feel like jury duty. Yeah, we're going to know what number one is then. No. I don't think but, what I do, but what I do know is my three songs are still on this motherfucking list, and I'm going to be happy. As long as your shit on the I don't care no more. I want some. Mm-hmm. Chris Brown got a lot of good songs. I don't know. But Chris Brown, Chris Brown, dude, this or the last one or five years. Chris I, Brown. I ain't gonna lie. I'm sitting here thinking of a lot of different songs. Bro, right, Neo ain't on his. Neo ain't on this whole list either. Uh, I'm. A, I don't know. All right, Troy. They still would like to be a part of it too. Yeah, I mean, that's Chris Brown, <laughs> Chris Brown and Chris Brown and Neo would like the two <laughs> Trey songs. That's right. I don't see. I don't see Trey songs in top twenty-five though. I, I think he should be Miles on the is, list, but not this one. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, no, he got a he had a couple, man. Trey Songz. How, how about Kay Michelle? Uh, what about Kay Michelle? Um, no. Kay Michelle on the list. We had list. like what no. one one couple no. a couple songs. Yeah, you know, we can't raise him again. That was a really a big song for her. We ain't doing that. We ain't doing. BSOP got a better hit. And we didn't put Alicia Keys. Um, 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 what's it called on here? 
Yeah, you don't know my name, some shit, bro. We missing some shit. If I ain't got you, it's a big song, though. Damn, you don't know my name is not on this list. Nope. You nope. Don't know. But it was on the top one hundred, so you can look forward there. And you guys disrespectfully didn't even vote it on. Mm-mm-mm. I just think irreplaceable should be on there. Irre- irreplaceable, I, I I agree with that as well. But people, I'm gonna like be Beyonce. honest with you. As much as as much as I don't give a fuck about this lady, I feel like <laughs> I, I really something don't. something Beyonce got to be number one. I'm be honest. Re- what number? number one. I, I wouldn't say number one, but I'd say on the list. Yeah, I'd say on the list. Right there, right there. Number seven. There you go. If Dangerously we, in love. If we talking about top twenty five. Of the last twenty five years, I don't, I, I, don't, I, I'm not, I don't know what song, but I feel like something with Beyonce in it probably should be number one, and that's me love being real unbiased because I don't like Shorty at all. Yeah, well, love on top then. Irreplaceable, love on top, and um, if you're looking at crazy, Destiny's in, style, crazy in love should be on there. We can crazy say in love. crazy in love. We could say love on top. We could say fucking cater to you. Uh, that's I mean, she's still Rolling in there. Stones got, uh, Rolling Stones got Dangerously in Love at three. I don't agree with that one. Dangerously in Love is a good song, but I think I think there was other shit she did that was even hotter than that, though. Well, not, not hotter, but bigger yeah, than that. Too. Crazy in Love was, I mean... What the fuck is that? Out of all of them, Crazy in Love probably the top. Where's the quotes on there? <laughs> the fuck is that? The fuck is that? I don't say her name, so she's <laughs> Quiezo Quoto. What the fuck is <laughs> The person that I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Every time her name came up, it's Quiz or Quota. <laughs> I'm glad you know to spell that shit. <laughs> All right, Laura. <laughs> uh, I'm not saying it should be top 25, but how y'all feel about Obsessed by Mariah Carey? Mm-mm. Nah. I don't even mm. know what the fuck that is. Nah. Nah. I'm not in the top 25. I was just wondering. So, okay. Uh, I thought you was about to say something. No, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that nigga had us balls in his shit. Yeah, he like so. <laughs> <laughs> this list is just it just lost as we uh, is. Ah, this went swimmingly. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I, I appreciate y'all for putting me. Let me put y'all through this bullshit because I just had to do it because Brandon used to do this shit to us all the time. So when the list Uh, came out and we did the list and I was like, oh shit, we can make a list? This is what we do with this nigga. So, uh, Brandon, I appreciate you, man, for coming up with this torture and let me use this torturous device. (laughs) I did have fun. Hopefully you guys did too. (laughs) I don't know what the fuck we accomplished, but we made a list, (laughs) y'all. We sure. talked about some shit. I'm saying we, we we did have some good discussions and shit though. <laughs> Pretty good. We talked about some shit. I mean, you know, I don't know if it's the best list, but we made a list. You know, uh, nonetheless, uh, Quentin Holzo made the list. Uh, Contagious somehow stayed at number one. <laughs> it was a list. Uh, but the most important thing is everybody had. <laughs> you know, so I appreciate y'all. Uh, we're gonna leave this list like it is. I'm gonna put this list out, uh, unbeknownst to everybody. Put under uh, construction on top of that shit. <laughs> yeah, this, this is a working project. So they know we ain't fucking crazy. We still we 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 know. <laughs> we know, nigga. This is work to be done. It's still, it's something. So you know what, raw. The the Marshall oh, Negro book is right next week, right? Yeah, we got plenty of time. Facts. We got plenty of time. Facts. <laughs> Cause it's gonna be a march to this fucking list. Facts. And this is this is gonna be that late night conversation right this here. It's gonna be a late night conversation. Uh talking about it. what is a good R and B list and what isn't? And this is you know, it was what it was. People came, they saw uh pause. Yeah, pause. We gonna pause this. Uh, <laughs> on some real, on some real shit, real quick. This list ain't 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 horrible, bro. Like no. we got some pretty good shit on here. The problem is, it's not a bad list. It was it's two two issues. One, 
I was evil in my uh, intentions of giving y'all the parameters and kind of telling people what to use. Um, and two, I just, I don't know. The the fun part of it to me is the debate. Um, you guys Please. have some very valid, um, you know, reasoning, which is the whole reason I like doing this. Um, even when we was doing it with Brandon, the whole thing is not the person making a list, but the person trying to qualify that person for the list. Um, and three, he did this shit off a whim. Y'all remember the top twenty, the top one hundred, where he's something he just randomly chose to do. Oh yeah, Real I quick. just found that list. Real yeah, quick. I just found that list and hey. like, hey, let's do it. Uh, that's how it worked best, man. I worked best just, you know, what I'm saying, just let's let's just do it and see what happens. Uh, but no, I appreciate y'all because, like I said, this was it was my chance to to do the torture Brandon had done to us, man. Making his like a, a motherfucker tell you like, hey. This is my top 10 list, but you putting his list together for him is pure torture. And then the fact that we make the list, and then it's like, all right, now who should be where? That's the fun part to me. Did you guys, yeah. there was, there was people moving. There were some movers and shakers. There's some people who probably could have stayed where there's that. There's probably some people who still should be moving. But uh, like I said, the fun of it all was just doing it. So boss, I appreciate y'all. Um, before we get out of here, wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, uh, <laughs> hey, before we get out of here, man, like I said, I appreciate y'all. Tell the people where they can find y'all, what y'all got going on. And uh, don't forget, y'all, the March of the Record book does start next Saturday at 6 p.m., so it will be a whole lot more mayhem with a whole lot more people. Uh, but I'm gonna let y'all go ahead and talk. Brandon, let's start with you. I'm about to say, this is what we can't do on the March of the Record Books. Oh, yeah, because you can't be <laughs> quiet for like 15 seconds. There's no dead <laughs> end. Uh, brand new show, social media platforms, uh, YouTube channel. Uh, appreciate you, DC, for letting me come through and suffer this torture. I see now what you were talking about. For all yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, being on the other side of it, the yeah. equation ain't fun, is it? <laughs> it, it, it ain't fun. It's hard as fuck doing being a host, too, ain't it? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Nah, to, say, say that shit, shit. Control. Yeah, that shit drove drove me up a wall. They'd be like, ah, damn. All right. <laughs> uh, I yeah, do it brand, again, though. <laughs> brand new show on social media platforms, Instagram, TikTok, uh, Facebook threads, all podcast platforms. Appreciate you, my brother, for having me on here one more time, man. Uh, if you need me, hit me up, bro. You know how I go. What's up? Eric, talk to the people. Yo, what's good? Hey, DC, first thing first, man. Thank you for having me on, man. It was fun. Um, false. Come, I had to say the shit for raw, dude. Goddamn. All right, anyway. Oh. Hey, yo, man, this your, this your little brother, Eric G. Hey, y'all, check out my podcast, Season 6, Random Thoughts with Eric G. is available now. Um, I got so many series coming up in this show. Um, the game night should be tomorrow. Um, finish the lyrics. Just come on up, man, and uh, finish the lyrics. Raw, don't say shit. <laughs> hey, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to uh, just like on, on the game show. I'm trying to keep the peace like I'm trying to do here tonight. So let's just have fun and um, can't wait to see everybody. For real. Uh, Brian. Brian B from the B Line ENT, man. we coming back. We uh, in two weeks, we have all shows returning. We got all new episodes. Um, a lot of fun doing this stuff like this. I love that, man. I'll be on Eric's show. I'll be on uh, everybody's show who down doing shit too, as well. No, oh, he found this shit. Yeah. Is that really him or that's CGI? Oh, he really auditions for Jago? He really <laughs> auditions for Jago. Look, look, too emotional. Yo. But why, though? But why? Oh, yeah. But oh. why, though? That was an interesting <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> yep we'll be back in two weeks uh all new shows everything's coming back we got some new guests a lot of new shit going on we actually gonna be uh doing some uh uh the new games and stuff like that we got coming live on the line a whole bunch of shit coming you'll see me I'm, I'm i'm gonna be everywhere again 
Bro. What happened? Oh, my bad. Uh -huh. Yo, I'll be your boy, boy. <laughs> I'll be like, your boy, boy. <laughs> hey, take my shit, like. I'll be your boy, boy, raw ass. Google me, bitch. I'm everywhere, nowhere at the same time. It is what the fuck it is. I, I got nothing special. I'm going to just tell y'all I appreciate y'all. Like I said, man, this list, I had fun. Uh, we'll be back with a regular show on Wednesday for Jeopardy. Uh, and then, like I said, the March of the Record book starts next Saturday. 50 hours of nonstop bullshit. Mayhem. Mayhem. Oh, I can't fucking wait. Uh, if last year was any indication, this year should be 20 times crazier. Because motherfuckers you, actually you, know each other now. And if you miss any part, do not miss from 11 to about 7 a.m. <laughs> yeah. That's what shit really <laughs> get crazy. I'll be wilding out. What? Motherfuckers is fighting they sleep to talk as much shit as they can. Yo, the uh the March after dark is what we was calling it. That that 11 45 to 6 45 a.m. where no lights was on and everybody was in their shit and the dark talking shit, it was mad spicy. Right. Uh, if it wasn't FCC rated, I'm pretty sure a nipple or two would have popped out somewhere. Nigga. That's a fucking fact. <laughs> that is definitely a fact. It was definitely, it was a definitely was a good bonding experience, though. Of all, all overall, uh, a lot of bonds was made. We we say out, we said afterwards, like a lot of people got to know each other afterwards, which was was a, was a really big thing. Um, if all else failed, like you know, what I'm saying it was at least thirty shows made out of all that. Oh, uh, people getting to know each other all, all all crazy, man. So it was it was a it was a great bonding experience. And this year, like I said, it should be ten times crazier because motherfuckers know what they expect this year, and we know what we getting ourselves into. That's for fifty hours of nonstop um, streaming. So be prepared if you, you need coffee, no dough, smelling sauce, whatever it's gonna take to get you through. Whatever time slot you in, or if you want to try to, you know what I'm saying? Because it was people, show after show, it was like, oh, we staying. Right. We start building. That shit was like a big show. ass sleepover at grandma's house. That's that's why it's so fun. The shit is like a party, literally, bro. Being oh, able to talk oh, with people it continuously. It was a fucking party. It yeah. was like, the next show come on. Hey, you got people? Oh, I got three. All right, we, we here with you, man. Don't even worry about right. it. Motherfuckers who didn't even have nothing else was like, I, I didn't know what I was going to do. Y'all help me. Don't even matter. We right here. <laughs> it was really just, you know what I'm saying, people helping the content, helping further the mission, and just really doing their damn thing. So uh, with that being said, like I said, it starts Saturday, 6 p.m., ends Monday, 6 p.m., uh, and everything in between is going to be all fun and games. Join that shit. Love that shit. Watch that shit. Stream that shit. Share that shit. Uh, till Wednesday, I'll leave y'all with this. Be safe. And uh, wash your goddamn hands. I had COVID, so I'm getting over oh, this wow. shit now. So mm. I've been home since Tuesday. Uh, and this is the longest I've sat at home. And this shit is not for me. Like, not being able to go nowhere, not being able to do nothing. I ain't even went to work. I miss work. Like, I ain't never thought I'd miss work. Like, yeah, after, that, I mean? after around that fourth day, you start, or third day, you start oh. getting antsy as shit. Uh, Tuesday, I was cool. And then, like, it started hitting me. Wednesday, I slept most of the day, but I still did my show and didn't really say nothing. Thursday, I slept all day. I think I got up at like noon. Mm. Um, yesterday, I felt better, and then I went and laid down, and then I woke up today at two. So <laughs> you got better, bro. Uh, the worst part of it all is losing your fucking taste buds. Let me tell you. Yes, that shit is fucking. When horrible. you go to I eat remember something, it. you can't taste nothing. Everything Bruh, just wow. tastes like like nothing. Like Yo, I was juice don't taste like orange juice, bro. I tell you, when I couldn't taste nothing, nothing. I was driving to work wow. and I was sick when I had it, fucking 2020, bro. And I had some toothpaste because I knew I was sick. And I went and put some toothpaste in my mouth, and that I didn't taste nothing. I was like, I called my boss right there. I was like, Yeah, I don't think bro, I, I think I got that cold. Had tea, it was just hot flavored water. Like I don't Crazy. know what flavor it was. Can't taste anything. Tea all week, That's ginger and shit. Shit is crazy. <coughs> I had that shit, man. Like today I had pizza and JoJo's and shit because I was like, fuck this. I gotta eat real food. Cause like drinking fucking tea and water all day and Gatorade and Pedia like ain't it. 
Can you still taste? Can you can you taste it yet? It's coming back. Like I, I orange soda because I, I had I was like I gotta get orange soda because I need some fucking orange soda. So it's starting to come back. I can taste it a little bit. It ain't like the full blast of oh, you know what I'm saying orange yeah. soda. It but, takes a minute, bro. It ain't like like I said when I first like the first two days like I had Chick Fil A uh, Tuesday like when I got off work because I left work at like twelve and I was like you know what I'm gonna get some food. I could taste it there, but like after like. Six o'clock, all taste but go. Yeah, that's just crazy. Nothing. Period. That's bananas. I ain't. I don't want that no Definitely more. ain't know it was like that, bro. I didn't know. I, I thought people was joking. It's like, oh, you lose Next. your taste buds and this and that. No, is that y'all first time? That's your first time having it. First time ever having it. I worked through the pandemic. You never caught it. Damn, you saying that shit like you in a rotation with that shit, my nigga? <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just saying. I know that. I know it's, I know it's still out there. But I got it when that shit was, you know, yeah, I didn't get it popping off, or whatever. Popping off. Like I worked through the pandemic and everything. I was doing medical yeah, service. I, I was delivering. I did the medical. same thing. I, I was, worked through the I, pandemic. Never had me it. too. Yeah, yeah I, I, I was. Had. I was in at CBS's and shit like that or whatever. I used to deliver fucking ice cream. And um, I remember when I got it, I'd walked up the stairs, yo, and just in my house, it's regular stairs. I walked up the fucking stairs, and I just sit in my chair. I couldn't fucking breathe for like ten minutes. See, the, I, was, I, just, I don't think I had it. Like my wife had it. Like she had like the more respiratory stuff. I just kind of felt like I had a cold with no taste buds. Mm. You know what I mean? We so had that like, shit bad. I didn't have a fever, none of that shit. But I was just like, I couldn't breathe like some parts, but I could. But I could. Like, the part for me was not tasting shit. Like that was yeah. like, yeah, that, that shit breathe. was wild. <laughs> like not being able to taste nothing. Like nothing tastes like nothing. Man, stop it. I was yeah. like, this is. I had well, glad you're feeling better, bro. But uh, yeah. I'll holler at y'all, man. Been a fun night, yo. Really fun night. I enjoyed this shit a lot. All right, y'all. I forgot to hit uh, record, but everybody got to see that. So, peace. We all good. <laughs> peace. <laughs> hey, hope y'all really enjoyed that episode. Make sure y'all go check out the website, www.whattheshitpodcast.com. Make sure you please like, subscribe, comment. That's how we know if we're doing something well. And if you don't like it, please let me know. You know, we try to switch it up for you. We want to be a podcast for the people, by the people, for the people, other people. So, with that being said, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you on the next one.